my god what's going on guys welcome back to pat outdoors today we're going to take out the 72 volt ultimate supermoto mx650 on the last video we installed the kelly controller that was programmed by electro and co and i've only taken this thing out in the parking lot i can tell you right away it's a whole different bike the front end just wants to pick up the power delivery is a lot more aggressive down low versus all the other controllers that i've had installed on this bike i think this is the fourth controller i have on here now um i don't know if you saw my last video i did a burnout inside my garage and it completely smoked up the place so i'm really curious to see if the top speed of this thing changes at all i'm hoping to hit close to 50 miles an hour we'll find out never been able to touch that that's always been my goal with this bike before we take this thing out we're going to be installing one of these Psych Plus GPS based speedometers on it that a few of you guys have recommended to me. Here's everything that came in the packaging. The user manual, GPS based speedometer, which has a odometer feature as well, which is pretty nice. I like the fact that I don't have to do any sort of wiring to put this on. The mount to secure it onto your handlebar, which has a silicone backing, which prevents it from scratching up your handlebar couple silicone bands to secure the mount onto the handlebar and a USB cable to charge the unit itself. Speaking of which, I should probably do that right now. If you are interested in checking this out, I'll leave a link in the description where you can get it. Here's how the mount looks like installed. It's pretty secure. doesn't matter since this thing's very light. So I'm just going to have it on there like that. This did come in kilometers though, so I gotta figure out how to change that. I think I figured out how to work this. You hold the settings button down for like three seconds to be able to change through different portions of the screen. In this case, I wanna change the main speed. So you, when you're in that menu, you can click the power button, go back to settings, change it between kilometers and miles per hour, and then select it back with the power button hold and it changes it looks like we're all set okay 84 volts fully charged the speedometer looks to be working well 16.3 15 14 13 got like a second delay state trooper should probably not go that way but we will
Oh. Finally hit it guys. Top speed. 50.7 miles an hour. I just looped the hell out of the bike and crashed it. Well, this is definitely going to put a pause on the wheelie practices for now. What do you think, Kiki? That hurts so bad. Uh, oh my God.